in three, two, one, go! And we're off match number 72 here at IRI. Blue Alliance, three game pieces scored up top. Krypton Cougars going back for more with their partner Hollywood. Over on blue, we've also got some bots placing one, two, three game pieces. That's Super Duper and Beak Squad. Each alliance has a robot engaged on the charge station. Blue coming into Taliop with an advantage of seven points, but red quickly catching up, narrowing the gap now. 56 to 54 advantage still blue. Hollywood quickly scored a cone. Their partner, Makeshift Robotics, right behind them, scoring the second link for the Red Alliance. They now need four more in order to get their sustainability bonus. Over on blue, 36-41, the flying toasters quickly extending up and dropping down a cube into a high node. That's going to be the Blue Alliance's third link. They now need two more for the sustainability bonus. 40-39 unfortunately got bumped by the flying toasters and dropped their cone. Now they need to go back and snatch another one from their human player substation. Moments like that really show how important it is for a lot of these teams to have a floor intake where if you drop a cone, you can go back and pick it up and not have to haul your way back over to the substation to grab a cone. Luckily for makeshift robotics, they're really fast, so it doesn't really make too much of a difference. They already scored one, two cones in the time that I explained that. Scoring another link for the Red Alliance now. They have clinched their sustainability bonus and gotten another link to boot. We've got 50 seconds remaining. Beak Squad lifting up and finishing up the top row for the Blue Alliance. Also grabbing a loose cube that was in the Blue Alliance's community and scoring it on a mid-node as well. 40 seconds remaining, Krypton Cougars, they're currently ranked third. The only robot on the field in the top eight. They know they need to win and get all four ranking points to stay in that position. They dropped another cube into a low node. Red Alliance almost has a full grid. Same with Blue. One more placement for Blue, and we have a supercharged grid, it looks like, on the blue side of the field. 15 seconds left, Red is trailing by nine points. 40-39 helping their partners get ready to balance. Over on blue, we've got a supercharged grid and three robots engaged. Five seconds remaining, Red needs to hurry to balance. One. We've got a result for match number 72, and it's the Blue Alliance with a score of 196 to 190. High scoring match, close match, only six points separating these two alliances. All six possible ranking points were earned during that match. It's going to bump up all three blue robots in the rankings. Super Duper Robotics almost in the top eight. Over on red, it's actually going to knock down the Krypton Cougars. They were third, now they're fifth. Shaking up the top eight a little bit as we get closer to alliance selections. Congratulations to our three winning blue bots.